G'day mate, welcome back to Gap of Mystery with me, Jitty. In our last episode, well, we spent a majority of the episode chasing after past Jitty, trying to make sure we fixed every mistake he'd made previously, and I think we got all of them. There is a chance that some have slipped through the gaps, but I'm pretty sure we've got all of them. I'm pretty sure we've fixed up everything, but um, of course, if not, we'll probably find them in the future. The other thing that we did last episode is I, I asked you guys, I asked you guys the most important question of all, being that we're playing on the crater map, how do we get down to the bottom? Now, the two options were build a switchback, a zigzag, you know, down the side of the mountain, or put in a nice, gentle, majestic ramp. Something was easy, we just cut through the mountain, quick and easy, done and dusted. And, um, well, the votes are in. The votes are in, the votes are clearly in. And um, it seems about 80% of people were like, no, 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 JD, JD, you're far too good at this game. We want to see the switchback. It's about the diesel of the fuel, the diesel of the trucks. It's obviously going to be far more efficient if they can just drive straight down a, a switchback rather than drive halfway around the island to then have a nice and easy ramp down. Now, I do appreciate the about 5% of you who said no, no, JD, you've obviously made your life hard enough. Have a nice, easy ramp, nice and simple. It'll be easier to run the belts. It'll be easier to run the pipes. Do it that way. I do appreciate you. I do appreciate you. You, you, you. You're in my heart. And there's about, I don't know, 10% of people that said, just do both. Just do both. Just, just you do it the hard way to prove that it can be done. And let's be honest, you're probably going to need to do the easy way as well because you're probably going to need that to run belts and stuff up, up, up and down the ramp. So we need to plan, or at least plan, at least start. We, we need to work out how we're going to start that project. There's a couple of other diggy projects that need to done, get done first. But it's going to be a long-term project, so we sort of need to start it sooner rather than later. Maybe we'll start it today. If not, we'll start tomorrow. I don't know. I don't know. We'll, we'll work that one out. Uh, but, but, of course, I, I need to ask the most important thing as the fog rolls in. Can I borrow a like? I'd just like to borrow a like. i like to borrow a like early in the video. If you're not happy with the video, you didn't enjoy the video, I promise you 100% like back guarantee. That means you can get your like back. It doesn't mean I give you an extra like for taking your like back. That's not how it works. That's not how it works. At the same time, I will remind you that the graphic you see on the screen right now says um, that you should hit subscribe. You should probably hit subscribe right now. I'm hoping not to have to update the graphic, you know, just for another couple of hundred subs, at which point I can just update it once rather than update it and then update it again. So I'd appreciate it if you, you, you just help a fellow out and save me having updated graphic twice. Cool. With that out of the way, uh, let's get into today's episode. And with the start of every episode, I need to thank. I need to thank those that go above and beyond, those that choose to support the channel, those that break open their wallet. Like, you know, Jenny, I enjoy your content so much. What I want to do is I want to chip in to make, you know, make sure you can pay your bills and also take away probably some of the guilt I feel for using ad blocker so i need to thank the wonderful the wonderful brand new youtube member uh Barrett matt Barrett matt welcome to the channel uh thank you so much for your support i do want to remember everybody uh, remind everybody who is uh curious why i'm not playing the pirate map and that is because i play that on the weekends over at twitch i stream every weekend over at twitch details are probably on your screen right about now providing you know eddie jetty's done his job at the same time i do want to mention oh god that's a long drive matt Cool. Uh, at the same time, I do want to mention, if you're interested in watching some of the previous well, streams, they are uploaded on my second channel, that being the Jetty Raw channel. It's Links are always down in the description. They're also probably on your screen right now. We're going to leave Matt to go for one hell of a drive halfway around the map, whilst we um, go deal with some other problems. Okay, uh, first problem I want to deal with is construction parts. I actually want to pause that belt. No, just the belt, not the game. Uh, and then put this box here. I want to... Fuck about... Actually, can I get Mark 2? I want to get the construction parts out of the way. I actually want to upgrade this... Well, these two boxes into one giant box because, well, I'd like to have all the construction parts out of the way. Also, the low food thing, we're going to turn that off, which should solve our low food thing. All right. Boxes. This box holds uh, 2,160 wood. So 2160, that's how much it holds. Problem is each tree is 20 wood. So it only holds 108 trees. And I think I have more than 108 trees down here. I think I have a lot more than 108 trees down here. So what we wanna do is we just wanna add a box. No, attach to that box, please. Can I add another box to my box? I'm gonna go with no, Judy. All right, so we can put that in there. We're gonna also add a box to our box with a box to our box. Yeah, 
yeah, that should do us. Uh, I'm going to set you to empty. You are set to empty. And this one's still set to, yeah, import. Which means we should get a flurry of trucks over here dumping off a whole lot of wood. Which should keep things rolling. Did Matt finally get down here? I don't know if he did. All right. Uh, next thing we need to do is uh, we need to pop up to the top of the map. Uh, there's a couple of things I need to do at the top of the map. Uh, we do have these guys building out of here. And I've actually cut them off right about here. I have a side project. I have a side project I want done. I want to flatten from there to there. Pause, because I don't want somebody to run over here and start adding material in the middle of nowhere. I want to run this through to here. I want a nice flat area across here, um, just so we can put in some pumps and dumps on this side, potentially if we need to. This is already covered by uh, the pier tower. So hopefully the trucks will get over here reasonably soon. The other thing I need is I need an expert. I need an expert and an elite diggy crew. Uh, the best of the best, because uh, we have a side project. Side project I need done. I want to go from about here through to about here. What I like to do is I would like to terrace this off, okay? I have a lot of area here that I could be using, except, well, it's full of stuff, like, you know, dirt. Uh, so what I want to do is this is level five. I'd like to come out here and I'd like to dig it level zero. Now that requires that I just, well, hover the mouse at five, drag it out, and then press the Q and E button to go up and down. So I want to dig this to level zero and I want to clear this whole mountain at level zero. Now it does mean that some of that material, um, you know, like everything along the edge, it's going to fall into this hole. Well, that's unfortunate. What we're going to do to counteract that is I'll put in a retaining wall. But not till after I've dug the hole. And um, we'll, we'll go through that probably in more detail when it's happened. I also need to make sure we have access, which I'm pretty sure is going to be like that. Yeah, that should give us access. All right, so now we need some elite diggers. I uh, also need to put in at least a tiny retaining wall in that corner. Can I... Well, can I build you first? Uh, can I have you export to this bucket, this bucket, and you? And that should do us. Uh, can I go to you and pull off two diggy boys and probably a number of trucks? And you only get three trucks for the moment. Okay, I want to put retaining walls in, like I said, uh, which I want to rotate. Uh, I want to put. There. There. Yes. And. There. And there. Not there. Now, uh, retaining walls. I get asked about retaining walls all the time. Uh, the long and the short is retaining walls hold things back five tiles. Okay. Well, five tiles in height. Uh, also, the corner pieces are purely cosmetic. You can choose to use them or not use them. Uh, it's there. Yeah, okay. Really? You drove to here and then you ran out of fuel? Okay, all right, fine, whatever. Build those. I just want that little corner done. We'll do the rest later. Can you, boss, you have no fuel, just drive over here for me. That'd be awesome. All right, uh, so you're, you're my little elite digging group. We're gonna have them just chew through this corner. Probably, uh, do I want to, you know what? Uh, hang on, where are we ramping? We're ramping, no, I can't, I can't bring the wall any further this way because the ground's gonna be too low. All right, that's gonna be our corner. Uh, can I put one more wall here? Yep, yeah, uh, so I get asked about retaining walls all the time. They, they basically hold everything back, the five tiles worth of height behind them uh, or in front of them, depending on how you look at the front and the back. I'm hoping to have a deep dive into mining and, and retaining walls and all that in the not too distant future. So I'm not gonna spend a lot of time on them now, but the long the shot of his retaining walls good at holding back material. Uh, you can press Q and E to make them go up and down. They have uh, the short version, which is the single tile version, the four tile version, the corner version, which is like a two by two, uh, a, a T intersection, which is also a two by two. It's just a cosmetic thing. And a T intersection, you know, in case you needed a T intersection. Uh, the barriers, Bar barriers are not retaining walls. They are just a little wall to stop a truck driving through it. 
That's it. All right. Uh, so that's the first thing I want to do. Second thing I want to do is the Diggy Diggy team. The Diggy Diggy team is all out of fuel and having problems because they are both digging at the top and the bottom. We can see these guys like, oh, there's no way for me to dig at the top. I'll drive around the bottom. Meanwhile, this guy's like, oh, there's no way for me to dig at the bottom. I'll drive around the top. So we are going to cut that. We're not going to do that. Uh, we are going to send them all to the top and I'm actually going to split out a section of them. Uh, okay, you. You're an old tower. You're an old tower you're using to control dumping. We're going to now use you to control digging. What I'd like to do is, um, this is at level five, this is at level one. Now, level one is too low for a dock. That has to be at least level two. Well, between level twos and five. And I'd like to, um, well, re-straighten out this area. I'd like to bring it down to level one. Also want to fill out some of this area here just to have more space overall. So we're going to put in a marker there and then I'm going to run you through to there. This should give me a nice 45 degree corner, I guess you could call it, uh, all the way along here. Now, I am assuming that this left hand half of the left hand side of this ramp at some stage is going to get removed because that's all quartz. Unfortunately, they put some quartz over here, so I'm going to end up removing that side as well. But that's a later JD problem. And I am more than happy to leave later JD with a bunch of problems. We're going to cut all the way through here. And then we're going to come down to flat. Flat, please. Cut out. Uh, no, I, I want the mining tool, not the leveling tool. Flat, please. Uh, cut through to there and all the way through to here. Now, I do actually want to use the leveling tool for some of this because if we go out to the edge of my pier out here and I use the dumping tool, we can see we're down at minus 25 here, which means this takes a long time to fill in. Whereas over here, we're at minus 12, 13, uh, 9, 8, 4. So we want to start, well, leveling this at the same time. So we're going to use the brand new leveling tool. I'm going to mark that right along the edge with a, guys, uh, I want you to dump and fill at the same time. Just dump and fill this whole area. Come on. I know, I know you're having an issue because I'm trying to drag out in the middle of space rather than start the edge, but that's just how I roll sometimes. All right. So we want to level that out, fill that in. Uh, they've done this section, which is good. Remove that. Okay. Uh, so we want to get this done, we want to get that done, and then that should give me a little bit more area. You can dump rock and also slag, please, and, oh, uh, where's the fuel truck? Huh? No, okay, it's not these guys. All right, what we're going to do, what we're going to do, we're going to remove, bring you down to 20, bring you down to 24, come to here, take you up to 16, and you can have 20, 19 trucks, 19 trucks, 19 trucks will do us. Okay, so we're going to cut this out. Uh, at the same time, this diggy crew, I'd also like them to start doing the exact same and I'd like them to start filling in some of these areas that they can to sort of square things out as they go. Uh, I really wish everybody get a fuel delivery. Um, where are you? You are trying to get to one of them. I think it's an issue trying to refuel on the run, which I already know is fixed in an upcoming patch or optimized. Yeah, I think that's the issue. All right, whatever. We're going to start digging this out. Now, this should give us a whole bunch of trash and other things that we should be able to push, put the trash system and burn. Oh, why don't you have fuel, fuel gas? Oh, I don't think we got all of past days mistakes. So you've been running this whole time with delivered fuel gas. Awesome. Okay. Uh, all right. Next thing I need to do is we have, uh, well, very busy trucks. Okay. And if I click on this and we go to analytics, we can see we are doing a whole lot of rock deliveries. We know about the rock deliveries. That is all our digging. We're also doing an awful lot of dirt deliveries, which is, well, these dirt deliveries. They're, 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 these guys are bringing dirt to here. Actually, if we bring this up and go exclude mining, we can now see a majority of our jobs are either diesel, diesel or really dirt. That's, that's really our two big jobs currently. Uh, so what I want to do is this is a priority nine. Everything defaults normally to a priority nine for emptying chests and that sort of stuff or filling chests. I'm going to change you to a priority 11, which probably means this is not going to get emptied, 
which is bad. I would like it to be emptied, but you know, it, it, it's, it'd be fine. So what I want to do is I'm going to change that down in priority. And this has now been emptied, which means I'm going to remove, oh really? Three construction parts. You're just annoying at this stage. Okay, uh, I'm going to remove that belt. I'm going to remove that. I'm going to remove that. I'm going to pay the 0.1 uni for you to go away. And then I'm going to put in a bigger box. Come on. Go away. Bigger box right here. And... Nope. Uh, just give me that. Delete. And spend a whole bunch of construction parts. Unpause you. And we're well, then going to remove that chest. which should get emptied back in there. But that means that I should have... Well, construction parts reflowing. Uh, also means that I should, 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 should be able to stock up a whole lot more construction parts, which is good because we're going to be spending an awful lot of them. Uh, what I'm going to do is, for the meantime, I'm just going to add in another dump box. So they can fill up 2,000 dirt plus 2,000 dirt plus 2,000 dirt. And um, as it turns out, these dirt mounds are a lot higher than I thought they were. I think there's an awful lot of dirt down here that we're going to have to pick up. Now, eventually, I want to shift up to the top of the map because that's just where we decide to store it. But if it doesn't get here and spends the majority of its time down here and then eventually gets dragged up, that works for me too. All right, with that done and that done, we're now back to busy, which is good. Uh, these guys are digging and filling, I hope. What is your issue? You're all full of trash. Well, you're prioritizing trash. The problem is the belt moves at 60 and you can take in 144, which means the belt's not fast enough, which means this recipe is only running half the time. Uh, we're going to upgrade said belt. Okay. And do we accept trash? Here we do. And you technically can't run at full speed because you take in 72 and the belt only moves 60. That sucks. All right, fine. We'll upgrade that belt too. It only matters because we happen to be digging up trash currently. But yes, it does mean that the trucks can empty trash into this box up to this point. No more, no more. But they can, if they have trash from the mining crews and they need somewhere to dump it, this is a possibility. We don't need to upgrade the trash output yet. And unfortunately, just because we're digging up trash from the ground doesn't mean... Oh, we actually we have a landfill pollution. Excellent. Cool, cool. Somehow digging up landfill, uh, digging up trash is increasing our landfill pollution. All right. Actually... Please tell me we, we didn't dump trash in the sea. Uh, dump disposed. Nope, that still says zero. Okay, okay. Uh, total consumption, mining. Yeah, yeah, total production. Yeah, there's a small spike in the mining. Okay, it's fine. All right, we will get rid of all the trash slowly over time. Uh, it means that this guy's going to be running flat out. All right, next thing I have to do. Next thing I have to do, steel, steel. We have a problem with steel. Uh, we have, well, all, a, a majority of our steel goes into uh, mechanical parts. Also, Mr. Shippy Shippy is waiting for steel, an awful lot of steel. We do have everything loaded up to go fix the dam ca damaged cargo ship. We have crew on board, so we might as well go do that. You, deliver. Cool. We can go fix that at least, but I need to get more steel running. Now, that means I want to put in another steel smelter which is going to be a little bit awkward due to, well, the fact that these guys are sort of built in at this point. We're going to copy this as a template and we'll put you here. Now, there's a couple of things I need to do. First off, uh, if I put this beside this one, well, obviously this bridge becomes useless. So we need to reroute uh, this bridge to, well, there, 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 there. cool. Uh, which means that bridge gets moved to there and we're going to build both of those and then uh, destroy that and that and that. Okay. All right, bridge uh, also means don't that priority input uh, doesn't change. All right, next thing I need to do is talk about these guys. So we have a blast furnace mark one, but we have researched advanced smelting. So advanced smelting gives us the blast furnace mark two, also the oxygen furnace mark two, and the cool caster mark two, and the metal caster mark two. So obviously I want to upgrade all those guys. So we're going to pull out you and put in blast furnace mark two. Uh, yeah, gas on that side. Pull out the oxygen furnace and we can put in the oxygen furnace mark two that way and then we're gonna pull out the cool caster and put in a cool caster mark two cool caster mark two 
there. Also going to click on that so it doesn't pop up anymore. All right. Uh, let's start with this gas pipe I don't need, this gas pipe I don't need, this belt for recyclables I don't need, and I think everything's... Nope. That pipe I don't need either. All right. So there's going to be a couple of minor differences. Uh, one, you process 24 molten steel in for 24 steel out. Also need 12 water. Twice that recipe. Okay, that's easy enough. Uh, you process 48 molten or, or, or iron in with 18 oxygen, which is the exact same, but you do output 36 more exhaust. So it's a little bit more exhaust. It's 50% more exhaust for 100% more molten material. Excellent. Uh, the old furnace took in iron or coal and gave us molten iron plus slag plus exhaust. You take in, uh, well, iron ore crushed plus limestone to give us coal or with some coal to give us twice the amount of molten iron with some slag. It's, it's more efficient slag wise. It also means we're going to start using some limestone to make iron, which is going to start complicating things because now you're not looking for just one resource to make one resource. You now need two resources that, that not run out to make one resource. Yep. Uh, so what I want to do is I basically want to slot this in here. But straight away I can see this pipe's going to be in the way. So what we're going to do is... I can't go straight up. No, whilst the pipe's connected. So we're going to disconnect the pipe to the houses and hope nobody... Uh, well, nobody will drown, that's for sure. Uh, okay, we're going to go up to height number three. And then I can't build that whilst that isn't there. All right, can I copy... Cut that... Yes, 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 no. Yes, 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 no. Uh, we need to put you here. Whoop. Yeah, forward one time. Okay, uh, I need to plug in. So this is going to be our slag, which technically is running the opposite direction. Uh, this would be our coal belt. And our iron ore belt will have to come back to. As for our water, uh, we're going to run two there over the top, down and into there, which now means you are the party line in instead, and we'll just get that built. All right, can I remove that? All right, next thing I need to do is exhaust. So exhaust is, no, actually, let's do the limestone. So limestone, oh. Uh, Limestone needs to come in. Uh, no. The height number two through there. We also need to actually crush the iron. We'll come back to that. Limestone needs to come into that. Slot. And it also is going to have to come into... I think it's in this slot. I think it's in the outside. We're going to upgrade that one. So we'll build it first, then we'll upgrade it. So I need to get... That's an odd spot for a slag belt to be. Uh, I need to get limestone here, which should be as easy as let's grab a bucket uh, and aim the bucket at the limestone hole. And as long as we can make one and one meet, we should be good. Uh, sure, I'm good there. Uh, you can go there. You're going to be set to limestone. And check that out. Okay. High supply fertilizer two. Okay, do I have fertilizer two down here? No. So our priority system is failing because too many trucks are too many busy with too many things. Five of you without fuel. Uh, can I get a dig order here? Okay. Why so many without fuel? Oh, I just realized I can't fill that in this corner. Can I get you edit area from there? That's a way better answer. Just the whole thing. Uh, can I do a N? Yeah, fill out that whole area and let's square that off to there. That's not too deep. Uh, can I go... That looks good so far. All right, that's that done. Uh, fertilizer. Hmm. All right. Uh, to mitigate this for right now, we're just going to crank the priority on this to an eight. Uh, playing with priorities is dangerous. One thing we can do is yeah, I have. Hang on. Uh, mining jobs off. Yeah, they're still trying to empty the dirt. Dirt and slag. 
and trash. Um, let's go with off. Oh, that's full. That's bad. Off you and two of you. I need to start just minimizing the digging for a little bit, just so the trucks can catch up. Once they catch up in the crew, I, the, the, the 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 job list will probably be fine. All right. One thing I can do is currently I have allow partially loaded trucks uh, to, to drive around, which means that if a box needs one coal, technically that's an open request. So we're gonna turn that off because I don't technically need one coal being delivered and see if that helps. Also, whilst we're making a crap ton of construction parts, which we are, we're probably also bringing a crap ton of wood from down here to the other side of the map. Yeah, we're just in a point where there's a lot of long distance hauling going on. An awful lot of long distance hauling. Wood. Wood. I saw a truck. There they are. Wood. Yeah, we're, we're doing a lot of long distance hauling of wood. It's not helping. All right, uh, steel, steel. That's what I was doing. All right, so this is gonna bring in my limestone uh, and then everything else we're gonna have the up upgrade in place or is already upgraded. So the next thing I'm gonna need is I need iron ore crushed, which comes from the crusher, uh, obviously. So we need uh, iron ore crushed 36 and I need two of those to run to these machines. Now, uh, ideally, ideally, I plan things out a little bit better, uh, but as we're on the crater, with a complete lack of space, uh, planning something we're gonna get to later. So what we're gonna do is, we're gonna bring out this belt uh, at height two, and run, nope. Uh, run sideways, and then height two all the way to here, and into here. Okay, after we've done that, we're going to, that pipe's in the way, uh, we're gonna, plan not to build that iron ore belt underneath. Now, it does mean that these particular smelters won't be able to get their hands on recyclables, because they're not going to bother plugging recyclables into this build. Uh, we want you to go into there, and you, nope, should go into there. Okay, so that should give us iron ore crushed. Uh, that should give us iron ore crushed into the build. That should give us limestone. Uh, that should be a belt that sticks out. That should give us coal and slag. Exhaust needs to go into... Here, and you're gonna output 36, which is 72 for two of them, plus 36, which is 144. That's an awful lot of exhaust from a pipe that's probably already awfully full with exhaust. So we're gonna see how this goes. Uh, we're gonna build all that. I need to grab my water pipe from you into you, yep, and obviously I'm going to need, well, 31 workers. Can we go to the housing estate and turn on the house? Uh, pause and unpause. Cool, that should bring more people in the estate. Also, at the same time, we're going to upgrade you and upgrade you. Okay. And upgrade. Uh, we also need to have an air separator, which would fit if I placed you before I placed the pipes. Yeah, I'm not deconstructing that just to make it fit. Uh, we're gonna put you there instead. We'll grab our little pipe, run it around to there. You also need a smokestack, and you're gonna need a belt to go from there to there. Also means I'm pretty sure at this point I need to actually upgrade the steel belt. All right, uh, minus 40 workers, they will come along in short order. The exhaust is something I'm definitely worried about. Also, no, limestone should be on its way. That is crushed uh, iron ore uh, paste. Yeah, that's crushed iron ore. You guys have uh, water, you have oxygen. You should be good. All right, so that should solve that problem. Uh, the ratio for oxygen didn't change, so I don't need a bigger air separator. Uh, we just need the, well, 
It must be construction parts. We may need the construction parts delivered. Okay, now that we've done that, it means that I can now look at upgrading my construction parts. So I want to... We're making four lots of construction parts. One, we're not using them. So therefore it's backed up. So therefore all those four machines are going into construction parts two. What's that belt? I am 18. What's 18 times by four is 72. Uh, I don't think you're ready for speed. Uh, can we get that upgraded and that upgraded? And you're at 24, 48. Yeah. Okay. So no, that's fine. All right. Uh, with that upgraded, we should be making four of these. Uh, four, four construction parts. One. We should turn to four construction parts. Construction parts two. Now twos, I do spend a, a, from time to time. Not all the time, but you know, 50% of construction at this stage is with construction parts two. The other 50% is with construction parts three. So I definitely want to upgrade this machine. Uh, also, I think we're going to put in a third. Uh, just because we could probably do with the throughput. Now, this means that when this is online, uh, what are we missing? We're missing limestone because that belt is definitely not connected. Okay. Once the belt's up and running, we should start firing you up. Yep. And you up. Yep. And that should give us a bunch of steel. 24 miles of steel. Come on. Yep. With the oxygen. Excellent. And then that should fire up you. Which should give us a bunch of steel out. Probably helps if I build that. All right, so you're going to be 24, 24, which means I have 48 at this point. Uh, when I pass through here and I add another another 12 to it, well, that is 60. Uh, 60 is going to come in here, which means this little belt is, needs to be upgraded because at this point I have 60, 72. Uh, plus this one and this one is going to add another four, 24 to it, which is 96, 96. So we need to definitely upgrade that belt. That one's already running at 200 speed, so we should be good. Uh, you need molten. You don't have any way to dump your slag. I knew I forgot something. Okay, slag goes from there to there. It's a very long belt. Uh, but that should do everything. Yeah, low supply of iron ore. Not surprised. Just turn on another machine. Okay. Who can't find what? All right, you guys are definitely stuck. Recover and recover. And recover. Right, you guys are fine. You're digging the top. Uh, you're going to come over and meet the sand nice and neatly, I hope. Maybe we need to dig one tile under the sand. Uh, sand, dirt, dirt. So we can then start using this as a ramp as well. Uh, as for this corner, they've done an all right job of clearing the area already. I'm obviously not going to have enough rock right here to fill in this area. So we're going to have to maybe look for other sources of rock in the future. Uh, and power's just been maxed out. Damn! I have to fix that. Um, the problem is space. We really don't have space. All right, power's back on. I, mm, I say it, then it flashes. All right, what can we do about power? Uh, I need access to water, which is why we built it. I think you're too long to slap in there. Mm. No, we could slap one here. Ashley. Ashley. No, because we're going to put a ramp here. Put one there. It's tempting. It's very tempting. Because we have water right here, which just simplifies the whole thing. All right, how much power do you do? You do six. So that's six, twelve. Uh, plus one twelve is thirty-six, and then a drive shaft only can have seventy-two. Okay, 
So, new plan. What happens if I put a whole lot on one drive shaft? It is very long. But is it doable? Not that orientation. Not that orientation. The only way would be right across here. But unfortunately, they're going to even get in the way to start with. Ship modifications complete. All right. Well, if ship modifications complete, can I load up the crew, please? And we can now say hi to, I don't know, everything. Uh, we could probably already say hi to stuff. I just hadn't bothered seeing the ship out. All right. We now have battle cannons. Decent ones. So we're going to go out and say hi to some of the locals. Uh, power will come back to. It seems to have settled just under. I prefer it to be just under rather than just over. All right. I want to grab some pumps and dumps. And we're going to put some pumps and dumps here. If I have some pumps and dumps, I can then go through the process of cargo dock. I want to put a cargo dock. Uh, liquid dump, liquid dump. Okay, there. Can I copy those and put them there? Now. That's our first valor build. Now the question is, it extends to the right. So unfortunate. Oh, we found a friend. Wrong button. We found, oh, we found two friends. And? Well, we found sugarcane seeds. We also found electronics two and electronics three. We haven't even got there. Oh, look, there's a prize here, prize here, pirate there. Pirate of 470, Pirate of 470, uh, Pirate of 470, 180, 430. And our combat score is... 430. Yeah. <laughs> the 480s we might be able to take. Obviously, the lower ones we can easily take. And now we need to repair. Uh, but we do have... So we do have steel. We do have construction parts 3. Uh, and currently all the twos are turning the threes, so I take that as a win. Uh, wood is still being filled. And oh, look, somebody dug back here. Uh, can I quick deliver you? And dirt hasn't backed all the way up yet, but it's going to very soon. All right, so we'll get another one of those built in. Uh, you guys are now out of fuel. We're going to need another fuel truck. Uh, we're down a stable, so we can throw another truck in there for fuel. And then I think what I'm going to do is I am going to try and work out where we're going to build a power plant. Because here is an option, but it does mean we're tracking the coal literally halfway across the map. Uh, whereas, you know, here is sort of not an option because we're going to build on top of the iron, but I'm going to have to build on top of the iron sooner or later anyway, but I, I can't access the bucket where it is currently if I build a power plant here, but it does mean I can use this scrubber. Yeah, I, I, I need a moment to think about this, but this is our progress for today. We, we, we still have the diggy cream, uh, diggy cream, diggy crew, uh, which I'm definitely going to pull five off there. Uh, nope, wrong one. Uh, put five on there. Yeah, and you can go back on there with a few less. Uh, struggling to find and reach destination. Where are you? Go oh. Can you reach destinations now? Yes, okay. Uh, mind control power, no place to put. Raw. Oh. Can you not put rock over here? I guess not. Uh, export to there. Yeah, that should work. All right, so this crew is gonna keep digging out this uh, this hillside we should have. Uh, can I just remove the top of those? Do we should have a nice neat corner along here? That's what I'm hoping for. Uh, and then the question is, do I want to cut it back further? That's another question. That's another question for another time. Yep. Yep. I need to take a moment to decide about this. Also take a moment to decide about, uh, where to put a power plant. 
but uh, this dock we're also going to have to play with it in the next episode. I'm going to set up a brand new shipping route for not food, technically. Technically. Yeah, we'll leave that for later. Yeah, uh, ocean access is blocked. It is just that one. We don't care. All right, I'm going to leave this for later. Uh, as always, thank you guys so much for watching. Do hope you've enjoyed. And like I said, um, the Retaining Walls Advanced Mining Guide is in the works. It's in the works. It'll probably be out. I don't know. I say soon, but we'll see. We'll see. Anyway, I'm going to call this video here. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. Do hope you've enjoyed. And I'll see you in the very next video. All right, bye.